Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. Today let's talk about Cheat Happens Aura. If you don't know what this is, it's a trainer program. What's that you're asking? It's like Game Genie or Game Shark back in the day. It's a program that lets you cheat on your games. And the good thing about this program is it's really easy to install on your Steam Deck. Unlike other trainer programs like Wiimod, that's a program that's hard to install on your Steam Deck. So yeah, if you're using a Steam Deck to play games and you want to toggle on cheats like Infinite Health, or infinite money, stuff like that. This is a good program to use, but there is a drawback. Um, this program is not free. Most of the cheats that you need are behind a paywall, so you need to subscribe to their premium membership. Okay, and they actually made this easier to install on your Steam Deck with this new tool called Cheat Happens Aura Steam Deck Tool. I made a video last year about it. It was in beta back then. It was free, but now it's past the beta stage and... They're charging you $10 for it. So, yeah, it's kind of questionable. I kind of think they should have, like, bundled this in with the premium membership because they're already charging you for a premium membership. And this is just a tool to install their app on your Steam Deck. So you don't really need this because you can use Steam Tinker Launch to do the same thing. But um, Steam Tinker Launch is not the easiest program to use. So I understand why they made this app. It's, like, a lot easier. But you don't really need to pay $10 for this app because there's another app that could do the same thing. It's just as simple and I'll show you how to do it right now. So let's go back to my Steam Deck gaming mode. Okay, so before we go any further, I'd like to introduce you to my secondary channel. It's called Growing Up Cooking. Other than gaming, cooking is also a passion of mine. So I'd like to share some of my cooking dishes, recipes on that channel. If you like gaming, you like eating and you want to support me, please go over there and subscribe to that channel. I'll give you some sneak preview right now. Alright, we're gonna kill it. Are you ready? Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Alright. Oh god, they put the sauce in. So did you enjoy that? Watch the full video at Growing Up Cooking. Links in the description. Okay, welcome back to my Steam Deck gaming mode. So let's say I want to play Red Dead Redemption 2 with the Cheat Happens Aura app on. In the past, I will just go to properties and I've got Steam Tinker launch and I could just load it. So I didn't really need to pay for that $10. But now Steam Tinker launch has issues. I'm not sure why. But uh, it seems like it's not loading anymore. It like it loads this gray screen. It says installing mod organizer, and then it just pops you back out. So let me demonstrate what I mean. You see, I'm trying to load. See this, like installing mod organizer, this gray screen, and then it just pops you back out. So I think there's an issue with Steam Tinker launch right now. But don't worry. What we need to do is press the Steam button. Okay, go into settings. Go to system, make sure you have this on, enable developer mode, make sure it's toggled on because we need to switch between windows, your game and the Aura app. Okay, that's why we need to enable developer mode. And then go into our properties, our game properties. I'm going to like disable this. We're not going to launch with Steam Tinker Launch anymore. Okay, and then I'm going to press the three dot button. Okay, you can see here, I've got a power plug icon. This is Decky Loader. If you don't know how to install this, I'll leave a link in the description. It shows you how to install Decky Loader and Cheat Deck. Okay, you see I've got Cheat Deck here. Yeah, that shows you how to install it. You just go to this store, the Decky store, and you just search for it. So if I type Cheat, see that? See the Cheat Deck just popped up here. Yeah. So you just go to Cheat Deck and install this. Okay, I've got a video showing you how to do it. You can watch that if you want. Okay, so once you've got Cheat Deck installed, go back to your game, go to the gear icon, and you can see Cheat Deck is right here. If it doesn't show up, just back out of it and click on it again. Probably takes one or two times to show up sometimes. Okay, so click on Cheat Deck. Okay, and then here, enable cheat. Make sure it's toggled on, and then Cheat Path. Okay, I'm going to select my cheat happens aura app so it's in my downloads and then in my aura folder i've got aura.exe so select this 
and then go to here, save settings. Okay, so once that's all done, you can just launch the game and it should boot the game with uh, the Cheat Happens Aura app as well. So watch. Okay, this is the Cheat Happens Aura and this is the Rockstar Launcher. If I press the Steam button, you can see I've got two windows open. Cheat Happens Aura and, and the Rockstar Games Launcher. Okay. Resume. Okay, let's go to Cheat Happens Aura. Okay, and then go here. I'm going to open up my virtual keyboard. Go type Red Dead. Let's locate your game. Red Dead. Okay. And then I'm going to hold my Steam button and use my right touchpad as the mouse and the R2 button as left mouse click. I'm not using a keyboard or mouse. I'm just using the controls on my Steam Deck. Now go to Red Dead Redemption 2. Click on it. R2. Okay. And then you've got to select the version. My version is the Steam version. So I'm just going to click Steam. Okay. And then go over here. Use Trainer. Loading. Okay, and you can see here it says game found because I've got the game booted up and then you click here, activate trainer. Yeah, you can see here I've got like a lot of cheats is grayed out. It's because I don't have the premium membership. It's free. This is the free. So I've only got like no fall damage, unlimited ammo and unlimited horse gallop stamina and game speed. I think game speed is the easiest one for me to show you. Okay, let me show you that. Okay, let me go into the game first. Okay, let's boot into the game. Okay, so if you like the video so far, please remember to give it a like. Click the like button. And also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Really helps out. So I'm booting into Red Dead Redemption 2. I've been playing a lot of this recently because I've been trying the FSR 3 mod on this game. And yeah, I kind of want to get back to it. Back in the day, I played the like non-Steam version, like the single player mode. And then I liked it so much that I bought the game and played the online version. So my actually my Steam account, I don't have like 100% save because I didn't play the story mode on my Steam version. I played it on a non-Steam version. So I might, I'm trying to like play the game in on the Steam version, go through the story. Okay, you can see this is normal. This is the normal speed of the game. Yeah, I think you know. Yeah, this is not. So if I toggle on the cheat to make it go faster. Yeah, so game speed, I'm going to toggle it on. Okay. Now it's toggled on. Go back to Red Dead 2. See that? See how I'm like moving a lot faster? See that? Yeah, it's kind of cool to play it faster. Yeah, so the cheats work. So yeah, you don't really need to get that uh, Aura Steam Deck tool that costs 10 US dollars. You can just use Decky Loader plugin, Cheat Deck. It does the same thing, basically. So yeah, just wanted to share with you that. Hope this video helped you out. If it did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.